Okay, today we're going to take the LCD off a uh, iPod Touch. This is second generation. First thing you need to do is remove this copper band right here. And I just use my case opening tool. You can use anything you want. I've seen people use a guitar pick to do this same function. You lift that up like that. Get it out of the way. Now, if this is the first time that the, the iPod's been opened, then the LCD will be physically glued. Well, not glued, but um, attached physically. Yeah, I guess you could say glued. It's a sticky type of, uh, almost like a sticky uh, sided, double sided uh, tape that they use to hold it on. So, what you need to do is, just like I'm doing right here, lift from the bottom, which is this side. As you can see, this still has some adhesive on it. And don't pull too high because, or too hard, because if you do, you will break the screen. There is a piece of, very thin piece of glass in this LCD, and if it gets broken, that's it. Call it a day, you're buying a new LCD. Okay? So, that's why I have these tools. Because they seem to work very well for this. I could, like I said, a guitar pick would do you. Anything that you can stick underneath to hold it up is fine. As you can see, I'm having a bit of an issue, but then I'm doing this backwards. Okay, there we go. So, once you get it up that high, the adhesive runs along the edges, right along here and here. Okay, so what I do is to take one of my case opening tools or um, these are tools you can get on eBay by the way and I run it underneath the edge I guess and very carefully now because these are plastic so they're less likely to damage anything so underneath and you'll break the seal on the adhesive okay now the other side's already been done but it's the same procedure just run it underneath and you'll feel it you'll, you know and it, once you get to the side you can look underneath and see it and basically you need to cut every single strand that's in there holding it down. Okay, at that point you can lift it up and now you have access to the middle plate which holds the LCD and everything else in place. This plate has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight screws. Okay, they all need to be removed in order to take the LCD off. The LCD attaches down here, but it runs underneath this plate, so this has to come off. Now, this plate also has the battery glued onto it, which is soldered to the motherboard right there. So you got to be careful with that. Okay, so I'm going to pull that up. Now, be aware that there's a data cable here, so be gentle with it. You can't do this too many times because eventually you'll break it. How do I know? I've done it. So, now we take a, uh, what am I going to use here? A T, sorry, a uh, Phillips Zero screwdriver. That's what it says on it. I bought, mine's a cobalt. This means, you know, it's basically something you buy at, uh, uh, you can buy this at Lowe's. They're like five bucks, six dollars. Well worth the money. They're a very good tool. And we take the screws out. There we go. And these screws are very tiny. I magnetize my screwdrivers because I like to be able to not have to deal with having to pick out the screws. There's one. If you want to magnetize them real good, use a hard drive magnet. Take a hard drive apart, get the magnet out of it, and you'll know how powerful those little babies are. Note that the two bottom screws are a different color. They're light brown. I don't know if you probably can't see it in this video. Uh, they're, and they're also longer than the rest of the screws. So keep those two separate from the rest. I can, I've done this enough times that I know. 
I can see them and know what size they are. But if you've never done it, it's key that you do this right. Okay, that's all the screws off that cover. Now you lift this cover off, which is somewhat somewhat tricky, but not really all that tricky. There it is. Pull it, and that's it. You see now it's come apart from the cover. As you can see, the battery's attached to it. It's it's uh, it's an adhesive that's pretty strong that's holding it on the back. Now. You take, well, I'm going to take my tool, but you, you can use your fingers, but you take your tool, and ta-da, and that's it. There's the LCD off the iPod Touch second generation. Thank you for watching. Be careful when doing this thing, and I take no responsibility for anything you mess up. Thank you.